Hamilton. All right, we're going to start this morning like we typically start our mornings, and that is with a pledge. So, at this time, go ahead and please stand, salute, pledge. First off, let me say thank you so much for being here this morning. Uh, I am Eric Mitchell. I'm the assistant principal here at Heartland. Uh, it's been an amazing year. Um, fifth grade, time of challenges, some changes, transitions. Um, got a couple more days. A couple more days, and then it's on to, to some other things. All right, so again, we're so happy uh, to have you here. Um, we're happy to have all of you here as well. Uh, in order to celebrate uh, these uh, great kiddos and all they've achieved throughout the course of this year. It's been an amazing year, uh, and we are ready to celebrate these, uh, these awards, these achievements, these accomplishments. So, uh, at this time, I'm going to hand it over to Ms. Campbell, and we're going to get right on into it. Thank you, Mr. Mitchell. And uh, for those that may or may not know, I'm Mrs. Campbell, the principal here at Heartland Elementary. And as Mr. Mitchell said, it has been a wonderful year here at Heartland, um, and it's always bittersweet because uh, this is an exceptional group of fifth grade students and your teachers would attest and uh, many of the staff uh, here in the building, and so we just wish them the best of luck, but they're going to be greatly missed, but they know they're also welcome to come back at any time to see us. So moving on, we're going to go on to our perfect attendance. Uh, we do have some students in fifth grade with perfect attendance this year. And I must say, Mr. Murray and Miss. Um, Mitchell's class this year you all had as a whole some really good attendance and you all earned some awards here lately for having perfect attendance but we have four students who also have had perfect attendance over the school year and we know that's a challenge with all the illnesses and, and things that go in and out of uh, our daily life um, so at this time Aaron Evans, Kush Patel, Braden Sun, and Tammy Tay are our perfect attendance no party, no effort. Great, y'all been around a while, so you're very familiar with Reflex. I must say our students did a phenomenal job with that this year. I'd love to also give a shout out to Ms. Duncan because she printed off this information for us. Um, we have a unique situation. We've had one winner per grade level, except for fifth. We actually had a tie. And when it came down to it, I'm like, no, they just both need to get it because it literally came down to like percent and like barely a percent. So uh, in fifth grade, the closest total number of green lights in any grade level comes down to tie in fifth grade. 151. Both students were in Mr. Murray's room. Okay? And uh, it came down to, like I said, the percentage of correct. And so, again, we just wanted to go ahead and acknowledge both of them. Zoe Martin and Luke Waddell. Moving on to our reading council board, we also had a fifth grade student there. Um, reading counts is something that we do here, um, in addition to like the reflex. Most points in fifth grade, Andrew Netzel. And then moving on, our news crew. Uh, every morning we have a little uh, computer. Uh, morning announcements and this crew did a fantastic job I must say. Aaron Evans, Huntington Benson, Archer England, Ellis Kamek, Emma Stinson, Zoe Martin, Emerson Berry, and Eden Kamek. All part of our news crew. Come forward and get your reward. To get our day started every morning. We also have our STLP, Student, Te uh, Student Technology Leadership Program. 
Uh, we have some students under the direction of Ms. Miller that went on to compete at the state level and did very, very well. Uh, those students, please come forward. Huntington Vincent, Cameron Dye, Archer England, Luke Waddell, and Tristan Gilkey. Moving on to our academic team, Mr. Mitchell's going to pass out our certificates for that because our coaches are already back into the classroom. Uh, we acknowledge them already throughout the school year uh, when they receive their medals and things like that after their competition, but we did want to go ahead and pay recognition to them again. Zoe Martin, Cameron Dye, Julia Moritz, Tanny Tay, Raylan Watson, Eden Kamick, Ellis Kamick, Cassio Ostergan, and Andrew Netzel. Next up, we are going to be giving out awards from our related arts teachers, and we're going to start with art, Ms. McCombs. All right, our fifth grade art award winners are Andrew Netzel and Eden Hammock. Ms. McCombs is also our beta sponsor. We're going to go through and acknowledge our beta team members. So, uh, starting with Andrew Netzel, Adlin Matthews, Olivia Wayne, Allison Mernich, Amber Williams, Archer England, Avery McDonald, Bradley Duncan, Callie French, Cameron Dye, Eden Kamick, Ellie Jackson, Elliot Wood, Ellis Kamick. Emerson Berry, Emma Stinson, Erica Asoro, Hannah Guthrie, Haya Yassin, Holliston Hager, Huntington Vincent, Jenna Light. Julia Losevitz, Catherine Schell, Leigh Soleil, Levi Gray, Liam Jensen, Luke Waddell, Melody Coffee. Mira Yassin, Molly Walker, Peyton Morellis, Raylan Watson, Tristan Gilkey, Tucker French, and Zoe Martin.
right, and uh, one thing that we value in Beta Club is service. Uh, our motto is actually lead by serving others. So uh, we want to recognize the ones who got over 100 hours this year, um, and it's six different students, and they actually uh, allowed us to get the pens that they all got uh, for earning over 4,000 as a club. So that's really awesome. Uh, Olivia Wayne. Cameron Dye. Elliot Wood. Erica Asoro. Julia Lozovitz. And Tucker French. Thank you, Mr. Combs. All right, moving on to our music award, Ms. Rose. Our music award winners for fifth grade are Raylan Watson and Melody Coffey. <laughs> Next we have Mr. Newman's PE award. And in fifth grade, that goes to Tyba Lang and Peyton Morales. And Tyba, don't go too far, because you're also Tyba. The fitness team, our fifth grade member, Tyba Lang. Congrats. Alright, next we have Ms. Clark with the STEM Award for 5th grade. And our 5th grade award winners in STEM were Liam Jensen and Callie French. under the direction of Mr. Mitchell. You may have seen some of these students in the drop-off line in uh, the mornings uh, helping out. Uh, if not, they are definitely in the building helping us out in the cafeteria, in the hallways, uh, even going into classrooms and, and helping students just get to class. 